Good morning. This is a behind the scenes look at Let's Try This Again. Uh, I actually don't even have a new copy with the new cover. I only have this older version of the book. Um, so I love the new cover. I love the new cover. You'll have to check it out. But I wanted to talk today about how I got the idea for this book. So we have a couple of friends. The reason I was thinking about this is because they actually just came out to visit and we saw them last night. They decided they were at a, a flux point in their life at where their kids were leaving the house and they were able to kind of work from anywhere and, and partially mostly retire. And they decided to reinvent their lives in a new state, in a new place. And when they were telling us this story about how they were going to do this, uh, I was just, my mind immediately spiraled off into like, what would that look like? And and what would that look like with a couple, you know, cause they're happily married and they were doing this together, but I'm like, what would it look like for a couple that was not totally satisfied in their life? So this idea that one conversation with them just spurred me to think about what it would be like if a couple was not fully satisfied, but was at this hinge point in their life and in their relationship. And one of them decided that they wanted to be done and to reinvent themselves somewhere else. That is where this book came from. Um, I love these characters so much and I think that this book is one of, well, I, I have a lot of favorites, but I this book is very special to me because I think it explores something real. It explores relationships when they're complex uh, because they're all complex, right? And sometimes in books, they seem a little simpler than they are. So I hope that that is what I was able to get across with this. Um, you'll have to check it out and let me know what you think.